Hi, welcome to SCW, the wrestling channel here on YouTube.com. Thank you for choosing the channel and choosing this particular video subscriber right now. Hit the bell on top, keep up to all uploads as and when they are posted. Like and share the video and leave your comments in the comments below. Let's talk wrestling. Now, Fastlane was the pits last night. It was average at very best, but uh, WWE are going to need to pull out all the stops tonight as we head to Monday Night Raw. Of course, it's the preview for you right now. It's going to be in the Allstate Arena in Illinois, and, uh, well, after Fastlane, it's been some lazy booking to say it at best. Going to go through the points for you now, what we can expect on Monday Night Raw, and let's hope. I mean, traditionally, this Raw is something to look forward to. It is the first Raw on the actual road to WrestleMania. There is no more stop gaps uh, between now and WrestleMania. It's four weeks away, so there's a lot of work that Raw needs to do. SmackDown started strong. Can Raw do the same? So let's go into the points for you right now. Of course, first and foremost, Goldberg is the Universal Champion. So, defeating Kevin Owens in less than 22 seconds last night. Um, we're going to see definitely some fallout from Fastlane on this. The, particularly maybe the start of the goldberg Brock Lesnar feud now for the championship and uh, we have to accept it it's what's going to happen um so yeah as much as disappointed as we are that Kevin Owens is not going to be the guy we'll probably see his reaction as well uh, is the blame going to be put on Chris Jericho and will we potentially see maybe a rematch clause invoked on Monday Night Raw this evening I'm teasing that it's not in the report um, from ringsidenews.com, but I'm teasing potentially myself. I believe Kevin Owens may invoke a rematch clause tonight on Monday Night Raw with Stephanie at the helm as well. A lot of blame is probably going to be thrown at Mick Foley's direction for a lot of the decisions that happened at Fastlane. We've only got a look as well at the Raw Women's Championship as well with Bailey and Charlotte. I mean, Sasha Banks got involved and it wasn't a DQ, and now Charlotte's lost her pay per view streak. Um, we've seen Charlotte throw out a tweet saying that uh, the streaks are not meant to last forever and that she'll be coming. Uh, for the Women's Championship even more now. Uh, it seems quite clear to me that this feud is going to continue and of course with Sasha, Sasha Banks and Nia Jax also involved we're going to start seeing the seeds planted for Wrestlemania for that as well. So it looks like Benning Charlotte is going to continue particularly with Sasha Banks and Nia Jax involved also. I think that that is definitely going to link to the Fatal 4-Way for Wrestlemania. Now uh, of course we're going to see potentially The Undertaker is rumoured roll this evening so could that feud with Roman Reigns begin this evening I think it's the best time to do it now the the, the booking decision was bad with Braun Strowman but it can be rectified um, looking at it Braun Strowman has to be it has to be his reaction that has to be the thing that will make Strowman stronger here um, maybe the Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal seems to be his destination um, which probably is not a bad thing because he would win at Wrestlemania and uh, he would be stronger for this, so maybe that wouldn't be such a bad thing. And to see The Undertaker, I mean, the key thing here, Raw Talk, uh, last night, if you watched that after the pay-per-view uh, fast lane, then you would see that uh, Roman Reigns describing the ring as his yard. Of course, it's The Undertaker's yard, so this clearly, the seeds have been planted, and uh, I'm hoping we're going to get the start of that for Raw tonight. So uh, that's pretty much all the big talking points there for you for Raw this evening. Uh, that's been brought to you by ringsidenews.com. And of course, adding my little bit of twist in there as well, a couple of my opinions in there for you on each of the points. So uh, definitely expect uh, the Goldberg and Brock Lesnar feud to potentially begin. Uh, Kevin Owens uh, to have a reaction. We can expect possibly the Undertaker to be there. Bailey and Charlotte to continue. Uh, we'll have to see what goes on elsewhere from there. But uh, it seems very intriguing what Raw will be this evening. It seems must see purely because of how other we're going to fix things after Fastlane. But um, we'll have to wait and see. I'm going to do a short video, which I hope that you're going to watch as well. going to be how I would have booked uh, Fastlane myself, taking the decisions that actually happened into account. So I'm not going to change the booking decisions. I'm just going to say maybe how I would have done it instead. So I hope you're going to watch that. I'm going to bring that for you. And then I'm going to put it at the end of this video. So if it's not on the end of the video when this is uploaded, then maybe come back and it will be put there and also as well uh, just check on the channel as well because that's probably the best way to do it so subscribe hit the bell on top to be up to date with all videos as and when they're posted i hope you enjoy monday night raw tonight and if you enjoyed fast lane or didn't enjoy fast lane let me know why in the comments below i've done a review on it as well but do forgive me i was really tired when i did it as well and probably was slightly tipsy as well not gonna lie uh did drink a little bit of vodka but uh still it is what it is and uh yeah let me know your feelings right now but uh, thank you for watching anyway this is the raw preview for you and uh, I hope you enjoy it for this evening.